Hi there guys and welcome to Kyle Reviews. Today we're taking a look at the Condenser Mic SF666 and no it doesn't uh, mean the devil but this is another bit of Timu tech it's mega cheap so the question today will be is it worth it? For the price yeah I suppose anyone could afford it I believe I bought this around three pounds something uh, so you know it's, it's cheap for anyone but is it worth that money still you know being a cheaper made microphone well let's take a look so there are different variations of this online if you do search condenser mic sf666 different versions will come up even with different colors this version i got um i got because i assumed it'll come with a piece that others did which was a jack adapter so basically it has the i believe 3.5 millimeter microphone jack there is no headphone ring to this if you know uh, if you look at other jacks like your headphones there's another black ring further down this didn't have it so this will only work in a microphone jack only so for example in my laptop i have a headphone microphone jack that's for devices that are headphone and mic together this will not work in that port it annoyed me when i found that out so there are versions of this mic that come with those adapters mine didn't i had to get a separate but getting your own is also mega cheap so it's easily fixed just plug it into the microphone side that's the headphone now this is a headphone and microphone jack so you see it's got the extra ring there that my microphone doesn't have that will now work in my laptop that's it that's basically it and just for even more uh, fun for you I then bought this adapter so this will enable it to work in phones because they don't have audio bloody jacks anymore built into phones at least main phones flagships so on my Xperia 1, if I want to do videos on it, which I am recording it with right now, I have to use a USB-C adapter as well. So yeah, funny games, but once you've got the microphone and it's set up, you're fine. Anyways, starting from, let's go bottom to the top. You get with this a nice little stand. It is lightweight. The legs here, they spring out really strongly. They're very stiff. So they're not going to close on you by accident during use, if you're moving it, whatever. I love this little stand, it's simple yet effective. And then the top bit of it where it holds the mic up and down very easily. It's got a nice full swing, it stays exactly where you leave it. I cannot grumble about that bit at all, it's fantastic. But let's detach this and move it to one side. We all know that bit's good, so that's fine. The microphone itself is cheap, but it does the job. So it's just a plastic build very very light plastic you can feel that there's like next to nothing in there and it's there on the name condenser microphone sf666 and sometimes a different variation will have a different sort of sticker here or some writing here whatever some other sort of brand name but it's all made by the same people that's for sure that's definitely for sure the shroud is a nice strong metal mesh can't grumble like that and i would say during use you're best off having the microphone upright so you speak into the wide side either this way or this way it doesn't matter from the top you're going to get lesser sound quality i did do a test on that already have it stood up in the stand swiveled all the way up and just speaking either side whichever way you spin it is all good uh, but other than that yeah uh, sound quality is another thing what i will do is i'm going to switch from this rear camera i'm going to go into selfie mode and speak to this directly so you get a feel for the sound quality as well and just compare it from this now phone microphone switching to the condenser microphone and tell me what you think in the comments as well i personally just at a slight edge prefer this but it's got to be close to you speaking from it speaking to it from a distance you lose sound volume very quickly so uh, but yeah let's do a switch see what you think and uh, just tell me in the comments uh, just a slight edit before we switch to the main bit I probably shouldn't hold this so close to my mouth so uh, just yeah think about that it will be on a desk or something normally for sound quality if it seems too loud on the voice thank you hi there guys so assuming this is working I will check whilst I'm editing um, this is the sound quality of the mic just so you know it is definitely the mic I'll move the phone camera away there we go the sound shouldn't have changed at all and when I bring it back now it's still the same so this is the quality of this mic the SF666 by Timu, uh, compared to earlier what was the phone microphone. So what do you think? For £3 odd, do you think this is worth it? 
personally I do just because one it's very cheap anyway so why not try it uh, you can roll it up put it in your bag and take it anywhere you go whether you want to vlog or YouTube out and about or if you're traveling to another location um, a studio or take it to work I don't know something uh, if it breaks it's, again it's cheap just replace it so yeah that's it thank you very much uh, let me know what you think in the comments please like subscribe and share and if you want to give this a try I would put, put a link down in the comments as well to this one that I bought or if it's not available anymore a similar one cheers guys bye